The U.S. Sun can exclusively confirm the stunning turn of events that unfolded in the days leading up to David, 35, and Marissa, 16, being ordered to leave the former teen mom two stars North Carolina home on what is known to fans as the land. A source told the U.S. Sun, David has been staying on Janelle's boat over the past week, but then on Monday, things began to get heated. Two days ago, Janelle started texting Marissa that since her father was no longer at the house, she could no longer live there, either. The insider said Janelle texted Marissa, I've raised you since you were little, but now I have custody of Jace now, and he's my priority. She kept texting the teen, urging her to leave, the insider said. Tuesday night at 9 p.m., Janelle knocked on Marissa's bedroom door, and said to her in person, I really need you to find somewhere else to go, you need to leave your room key and go in the morning, the source added. On Wednesday morning, Marissa took her key and went to school as usual, as David had told her to do, but Janelle kept texting her all day, the insider said. When Marissa got home from school, she ended up packing up her things and leaving, the source said. David is supposed to be filing for divorce sometime today his plan is to get ahead of Janelle filing, the insider added. The U.S. Sun reached out to reps for Janelle and David for comment. YouTuber LB first revealed that Janelle kicked Marissa out of the house this week. As the U.S. Sun first exclusively revealed, David is currently facing a felony assault by strangulation charge for an attack on Janelle's oldest son Jace. In the fallout of the alleged attack, a Child Protective Services investigation was opened and Jace was in CPS custody up until last week when they suddenly dropped the case and Janelle regained custody. Multiple sources have told the U.S. Sun that there is a no-contact order between David and Jace, so when Janelle got custody back of the teen, there were questions about how David would remain at the home.